I want to. I want to break some right now. Ah! Oh, wow. Wow! 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 The race was great. Um, I'm not going to go for this, you know, normal post-race stuff. Race was really, really good. Race was fun. It was awesome. First two stages were, well, stage one was, um, was nothing really happened. We expected nothing to happen. Lagana won both stages. Stage two, we saw a really good strategy with, you know, Chevrolet's pitting early, I think, 16 laps into stage two. Then the Fords and Toyotas were out on their own. Um... We just saw a lot of different strategies play out during that took place in every stage, which was very fun to watch. Um, as for um, like Sir Johnson was on fire, that uh, he was really, really in on a roll. Um, uh, Kosh came out with like what five laps to go. Logano, being the driver that he is, makes an ass out of himself. I know the wreck wasn't his fault. I know that. Um, uh, Hamlin got it, you know, didn't uh, hit him square enough, got uh, Logano turned. But the, the laps before that, Logano was caught, was, he was trying to cause a wreck, uh, for sure. Um, yeah, so De Benedetto is in, Johnson is out. I'm happy for Byron, but like I can't, I, I can't be happy because like we're so close. <laughs> oh, again, I do apologize. It's not gonna be your typical post race review. Just <sighs> yeah, um, yeah. Congrats to Byron. Uh, congrats to Jimmy on a stellar career. I mean, these last two seasons does not define everything that Johnson has done for the sport. Seven championships, 83 career wins. You cannot take that away from him, despite what he's been through these past two seasons. Um, it just would have been really cool to see him go out on a high note, or at least go out with him in the playoffs. So, yeah. Don't know what else to say. Um... <laughs> All right, what are your guys' thoughts on this race? Again, I enjoyed this. This was a very intense race. I was very skeptical uh, NASCAR moving this to August as a regular season. But I'll tell you what, they knocked it out of the park. Even though it's a massive gimmick and I don't like that, I'll tell you what, NASCAR, they did a uh, bang-up job. They knocked it out of the park. Um, yeah. Wow. That is... Oh my God! There were so many times I was like wondering, "Come on!" Like I, I'm not, I'm not a type of person that is wishing for Rex, but I was like, "Come on!" Just someone clip to Benedetto or someone clip Byron. Come on! Um, but no. Um, yeah, we'll see what happens next weekend at Darlington. Should be a fun weekend there with Throwback. Um, oh my God, man! Look at how close. Yeah, again, really enjoy this race. I'm just rambling on. Thank you guys so much for watching the post-race show or victory stuff. I don't even know. I don't even really care. <laughs> ah, man, oh, man. This, oh, my God. Still 2020, man. I'm surprised that only, we only had two big wrecks. I mean, the way these guys were racing, we should have had five wrecks. I mean, it was really aggressive, extremely aggressive, especially, the I think, the entirety of stage three. Uh, especially the last 50 laps or so of the race, things start to get really, really aggressive. And um, yeah. Yeah. So the drivers that will be fighting for the championship is Harvick, Hamlin, Kozlowski, Logano, Elliott, Truex, Blaney, Bowman, Byron, Dillon, Custer, Almarola, Boyer, Kurt and Kyle, and Di Benedetto. Yeah. All right. I I'm going to go lie down and cry. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time. Ah!